What's up you guys, Ethers Mystical Child here, coming to you with a pick a card, hope all is well with you, and hopefully you'll like this reading, it's kind of fun, it's not so serious, the title is, Who's Masturbating to You, so take what apply and leave the rest, and the timestamp is going to be in the description box and the message box, subscribers know old, hopefully you're enjoying your summer because it's almost done, and if you're a visitor, welcome. Return of visitors, welcome back. My fingernail polish is chipping. So we have POW 1, POW 2, POW 3. If you want crystals, POW 1 would be the Jade. POW 2 would be the Green Aventurine. And then POW 3 would be the Lapis Lazuli. So... Pick your pile. One, two, three. I'll see you in pile one. Pile one, if you pick this jade or if you pick this deck, this is your reading. Shout out to you guys. Hope all is well. Hopefully you could get some messages from this reading. The title is, Who's Masturbating to You? We're going to figure out why they're masturbating to you. So this is just... A spread of who is masturbating to you. Take what apply, leave the rest. Shout out to my subscribers, new and old. And if you're a visitor, welcome. Returning visitors, welcome back. So this person who's masturbating to you, this person lost someone in the last year, someone close to them, a loved one. They make valuable things with their hands. So they could be a chef a landscaper, a beautician, someone does makeup, um, electrician, just examples of who this person could be in your life. That could resonate, could not resonate. It says your first kiss will be in a year from now, so some of you don't know this person or you don't know them to that degree. This person doesn't have any siblings for some of them for some of them may have three siblings this person want to send you a message they could have a darker complexion this person grew up with like in a struggle for some of them because it says it grew up in a household better than average and it's in reverse it says already know this person it's in reverse so some of you don't know them Take what apply. It says hum often. So this person likes music. They like to hum a lot. So that's just some descriptions of who this person could be. Clarify wants to send a message. Who's masturbating to power number one? It says ten of pentacles. So this could be somebody that is an older person. This person also could be somebody that lives with their grandparents or live with their parents. With the Ten of Pentacles, it could be somebody from your past. It could be an ex that's wanting to send a message to you. The Two of Cups is here. No, not the Two of Cups. The Three of Cups. So it could be somebody in a friend group. It could be somebody that you left in the past because of them having a third party. says yeah 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 so it could be true for some of you clarify this three of cups and this ten of pentacles who's masturbating to power one some of you was in a relationship with this person two of cups you might want to say the two of cups and then I thought it's the three of cups it's the two of cups and the three of wands somebody didn't pick you somebody went the wrong direction this is the person who's masturbating towards you when I said the third party you have the three of cups and you have a three of wands this person is a person that definitely um, was mixing and mingling with other people and you guys relationship was a crucial relationship to them whichever way was crucial you could 
if this is is somebody masturbating to you so i'm not looking outside of a relationship or anything i'm not looking at family or any of that when i said this could be a crucial relationship to you this person you you guys were supposed to build something together you were supposed to go a, a little distance or create a family or something this was a important relationship but this person did not um pick you they went the wrong direction like i was saying before Somebody feel left out as well right now. They feel left out. They feel like they feel depressed. This person is drowning in their emotions behind this. This person could be a Scorpio or have it in a seventh house or in a Venus or in a Mars or in a Neptune. It could be in a moon too, but this person has strong Scorpio in a, um, in a chart. Clarify, uh, wait, hold on. Clarify makes something valuable with their hands. Who's masturbating to pop? Says the emperor. Could be an Aries, could be a Libra. It could be somebody who's in a relationship with it. It could be your ex-husband. But this is who it is. This person is thinking about the, that the, the fact that they did not choose you. You have the five of wands and the reverse on the bottom. They wish they didn't bring all this conflict to you. All this conflict, chaos, and confusion to you. Because some of them, now they can't make their way back to you. And they look at you as a best friend, a good friend. Somebody that they could have built with. And if you did build, build these ten of pentacles, they damn sure wish they never went the opposite direction. For some of you guys, when they masturbate in, they could be doing um, candle magic on you. For some of you. Let's see. Clarify your kiss will be in a year from now. Who's masturbating? You have the seven of cups. You have judgment. This judgment looks like the devil is judging this person. Yeah, there's a devil, an entity, a demon a devil um, judging this person. So this person looks like they, they um. Yeah, there's two people. There's a yeah. There's. This could be a female being judged. Yeah, but the underground, the underworld is definitely judging this person. Why does this look so dark? The underworld is definitely judging this person, though. Let's say that. You have the King of Cups and you have the Page of Cups. When, is, when I clarify your first kiss will be in a year from now, this person really want to be with you. They want to date you. This person could be a Scorpio for sure, for sure. King of Cups, it could be a Scorpio or a Taurus. But this person could be a Cancer as well. They want to be with you. This person, when it says the kiss will be in a year from now, for the ones who don't know you, they really want to be with you, this person who's masturbating towards you. They see you as somebody that's loving, somebody that's balanced, somebody that's creative, somebody that's nurturing. Somebody could be a Pisces here. Some of these people cry about you, though. They cry for the ones who know you. It just get them very emotional thinking about this. Okay, let's see. Let's get out of this. The judgment is still on the bottom. Clarify the judgment. Why is the judgment here? The Three of Cups came back out. This person partying. The Queen of Swords. This person was partying with a Queen of Swords. A Libra, Gemini, or Aquarius. So this person have a strong in a chart. Yeah, these, this, I'm not going to show it to you because this card, the uh, YouTube likes to get sensitive. But it's the Three of Cups. This person was frolicking. Frolicking with some other third party. And one of the third parties like other girls. So this person is into threesomes. Or this person could like the same sex. Or this per well, those two apply. Also, this person could have been your friend. Or in your friend group that they uh, was looking at or decided to go cheat with. This is why they're being judged. Yep, 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 yep. Alright, let's come out of this deck. Let's see why. They are uh, masturbating. It's, it's kind of... Hold on for a second. Hold on. 
for some of y'all, when I said that the underworld is uh, judging this person, their ancestors are mad at them as well. With this Two of Cups and this type of relationship that this was, for some of you guys with the Ten of Pentacles, their ancestors are not happy with them. Clarify this Three of Cups. Why is this person masturbating towards power? One. This is a person that could feel privileged or entitled. They feel like they could do this. This could per person could be a person that's oppressive or somebody that's racist. And they, this is, could be a person that think love is supposed to hurt. This person is detached from their emotions. Exposed want to come out. This person don't want to know, want you to know this information. Clarify this judgment. Why they masturbating to power. It says been burnt. Afraid to love someone again. Unhealed trauma runs away. Well, I just said that. This person likes to detach from their emotions. This person is a person that's like, like I just said, they, this person, hmm, how can I say? This person have been hurt in their past. Some of them wasn't even raised with emotions. So they're not an emotional type of person. But for some of them, they past traumatized them. So they try to like detach themselves from the, their emotions. Clarify, oh, show off came in reverse. Needs to prove themselves insecure, exhibition, exhibitionist. Yeah. Dangling with partial truth, needing answers, shifting. This person is immature. This person don't know how to uh, emotionally be vulnerable with people. So they like third parties. They like to bring people into their mix so they won't have to be vulnerable. So they can cause confusion and chaos. It says roving eye and deadly combo. Clarify this two of cups. It says mirroring. Reflect your own issues. Like attracts likes. So some of you have the same childhood wounds or the same wounds that keep y'all um keep y'all tied to one another and it also keep y'all in a destructive relationship. Some of you guys walked away from them potentially. It doesn't really show it here, but clarify this emperor. Tangled web, convoluted, justifications, caught up in trance. This person with this emperor energy, Aries um, energy, think everybody is a, is a conquest to them. Like another notch on a belt. So this is the type of energy this person, and it says tangled here again. Tangled web, tangled. Unable to free yourself from a sticky situation. Talk, taking a step back helps you see clearly. I told you, this person... Yeah, I already explained that. That was a download, but I'm not going to be able to repeat it because I kind of forgot what it what I said. But I had just said it before I just said this. So, yeah. Clarify this emperor why he's masturbating to power one or why she's. Because this could be a female and her masculine energy as well. These just came in reverse. But I... This person, like, okay, this person likes to go through, a, like I said, this person look at everybody as a conquest, a merry-go-round. And this person likes to walk, they like the walk of the shame. So this person is a person that, they're very reckless when it comes to sex. They can leave a party and go with somebody to their house and have sex with them. They, they, this is that type of energy when it says to walk of shame. This person does things that doesn't even make sense to them all the time. But this person is wounded and, and traumatized. This is why they're masturbating to you because they want you back. Some of them can't get you back. Some of them don't know you and don't have enough balls to come to you and let you know they want to be with you because they still trapped up in a wounded energy and not healing themselves. Other of, of Others of them like this energy. They like being stuck in this toxic energy and having the third parties. Is it working out for them? No. And look, the Seven of Swords. They love being deceptive. They love hurting people. They love being manipulative. They, I call this person right here, the Seven of Swords, is Mr. Don't You Know No Good. So, yeah, this is why they masturbating to you and who's masturbating to you. They want you back. They traumatize. They need to heal themselves. And a couple of messages in between that that I stated. But, yeah, real quick, let me see something. Where's this person mental? Why are they masturbating towards power one? I think love is supposed to hurt. Or be painful. That's all I've known or seen. I told you this. My childhood love hurt me more than you know. I've never healed from it. I express that. 
I'm living a lie. I'm not strong enough to change this issue. This person walking around with baggage. This is Mr. Don't You Know No Good. A snake only sheds its skin to become a bigger snake. Always remember that, collective. This person, if they come back to you, they haven't changed their ways. They just became a bigger snake. They have found bigger another way or other ways to try to deceive you. So if you have gotten something from this, like and or subscribe. You hear this? Your love is life changing and it can't be the same without you. I grew up in a household full of narcissists, a bunch of narcissists, con artists, liars, manipulators. This is their story. So I'm going to Pow 2. Like and or subscribe. Till next time in Tarotland. How to? If you pick the green adventurine or if you pick this deck, this is your reading. Shout out to you guys. Hope all is well. Hopefully you could get some understanding from this reading or some messages. When I say understanding, you can understand why this person is doing this. The title is, Who is Masturbating to You? I'm going to try to figure out why. Shout out to my subscribers, No Old. What's popping with you? Hopefully, if you're in the state, you're enjoying the last days of the summer. I haven't done a reading for you guys in a minute because I was on vacation. So, I'm back. And if you're a visitor, welcome. Returning visitors, welcome back. So this person who's masturbating to you, take what apply and leave the rest. This person has been in your proximity. Uh, my tongue just twisted. This person has been in your proximity at least once in the last six months. They like to wear meaningful accessories, whatever that means to them as meaningful. They could wear hats, rings, you know. They could wear bracelets, you know, accessories. They own their own home or they live by themselves, potentially. Or if somebody lives with them, it's their place. This person have an odd number year, birth year, like, um, I'm just throwing it out there. 73, 71, let's see, I don't know, those just two things came to my mind, but those are odd numbers. There could be a three to five year age difference between you guys. It could also be an eight year age difference. This person makes something valuable with their hands. So this card came out in Power 1. Shout out to you guys who've been in multiple Powers. Or if you want messages for Power 1, go over there. This person could be a fire sign as well. A Leo. A, a, I was about to say Aquarius because that's the flip side of a Leo. A Leo, a Aries, or this person could be... What's the other one? I'm getting a headache. My brain just went blank for the other side. It's a Sagittarius, and I know it. But my head's starting to hurt. Maybe this person make your head hurt. I don't know. Let's talk clarifying. Um, clarify makes something valuable with their hands. I was going to say the power one when this card came out. It's funny that they make something valuable with their hands, and it's a masturbating um, reading. So, yeah. The three of cups came out, and the two of pentacles came out. The Three of Cups came out in Power 1 as well. So, clarify and make something valuable with the hand two of coins. This person juggles a lot of things. They could have a job where they have to um, juggle a lot of things or they're in charge of a lot of things. This is a person that tried to um, stay away from trash. Or people that behave like trash. But this person could be a person that get caught caught up in it. Get caught up in the that, that type of energy of dealing with these type of people. These people, this person likes to juggle people as well. They always have somebody they juggling. With this um, three of cups. This person's name could be Sharon or Luke. This person could be a Gemini. Dealing with this person could be like a whirlwind or they could be like an energy vampire for some of them. Some of them could be like, they could give you an a, a, a energy of like they have anxiety or they, they are kind of frenetic, always in a frenzy. That's what I'm getting from this. This person prob is a person that they could have bad teeth as well. Somebody like apples and bananas and fish. Yeah. Okay. Um, temp the pick.
Page of Pentacles came out. Somebody's name could be Matt. Tell me about this Page of Pentacles. This person could be smart, very smart, like borderline genius. They could be good with math and, and um, science and technology and stuff like that. Engineering. They could be an engineer. They could be a teacher. Clarify this page of coins. The five of wands came out. And then the... Um, you have to use your intuition with this because this card is starting to cross it. This is the five of wands. But you got to use your intuition with this person. This is a person that like to mug people, like to rob people. You have to be wise around this person. This person is a money-hungry person with this page of coins. They do things for money. They betray people for money. For some of you guys, take what apply and leave the rest. Five of Wands is all about competition. Five of Wands is all about violence as, as well. It could be police activity. This person could sell drugs. This person could be a person in a community always warring with people. Or this could be a person that have to defend themselves from people like this as well. Somebody name could be Marcus or Matt. Um, hold on. Let's kind of switch gears a little bit. I want to switch gears for sure. Clarify this page of coins. Why, why they masturbating towards power one? I said power one. Scratch that. I meant to say power two. Um, Clarify um, pal, what I'm talking about. <laughs> All of a sudden, this person could be a person that's scandalous as well. And they could be a fake person, a person that act like they're busy, but they fake busy. This person could be a person in the community that um, either have, like, have a multiple baby mothers, or this person could be a person that don't know their baby mother, baby father or they don't know their um they don't know their baby father or this could be a person that have pregnancy scares like getting people pregnant and stuff like that if it's a guy and a child don't belong to them it says brief of fear on the bottom brace for a sudden ending short but sweet can't last so this could have been a relationship you was in and it ended abruptly this person is a person that like or this could have been a sneaky link of yours. Take what apply, leave the rest. Clarify this five of wands. Why are they masturbating the power one? Because this seems like a lot of time is just going by and I'm not getting nothing out. This person is like a, a person that likes to live in a fantasy, in an illusion. They don't delve in real love. This person could live in a city. Or you could have gone out on dates in a city with this person. It says, you know something isn't right. Don't be afraid to speak out, it will set you free, so yeah, you guys were in a relationship with this person, somehow this relationship broke up, it's very, very, like, obvious that this relationship broke up, um, with the three of cups here, the two of coins, this person always juggling, and with over here, this, yeah, this person, clarify, um, this page of coins and five of wands, who's, Masturbating the pal too. I'm about to come out of this pal because I just this I don't like the it says silent treatment in reverse and all or nothing. This is a person that uh get caught up in romantic uh love affairs. This is the type of person that like the idea of romance, but they don't want to commit to nobody. This person talks to a lot of different people. The walk of shame was on the bottom of the deck. That came out in power one. So I'm not going to take that. You want that insight, you could go to power one for that. Clear. And no contact. They are trolling you. Internet community investigate. Okay, so this person is investigating you. This person is trolling on your, um, on your social medias or whatever. And all of a sudden, my headache just went right away. This person is exposed. I know that. They tried to stop me from exposing them. they just been exposed. That's my headache just went right away. This person is a person that is on just really stalking you. This person is a passionate person. Some of you could have met like out of nowhere. Like I won't say out of nowhere. Like the universe has you at the right place at the right time. Or for you could say the wrong place at the wrong time. Or the wrong place at the right time. 
could have been like love at first sign. This, I want to say um, it could have been love at first sight for, oh, for you guys. This could have been a lustful relationship. It's two indicators that this person is a fire sign, so a strong fire sign. This person is a Leo. Oh, came out a Leo. Damn, it's three indications. Strong fire sign. This person is a Leo, and they need a lot of attention. It says situationship. Live in relationship. It's a secret. So it could have been a situation. You could have been living with this person. You could have been a secret. Three ways to decide who this person is. This is this person masturbating towards you. Let's see what a mental space is. Why is this? Because I'm about to go to pile three. I don't know what real love feel like or um, look like, so I doubt what we have together. So my mother made me codependent when it comes to relationships. So this mother of theirs um, traumatized them. They neglected them or they loved on them too much, but they traumatized them. When it says they made them codependent, this person is a person that they mother just seen no, no wrong in them. It's like they mother just like blind to the, the chaos and crazy that they did. The mother never checked them as a child, so they grew into a, a monster. I didn't plan on meeting you, let alone falling for you. If I can have sex with you, be careful. My sex. Okay, so some of you are very spiritual and you have kundalini sex. So this person is masturbating towards you because they messed up on a good thing. They messed up on somebody they know they would never get again. Somebody that they were supposed to commit to, but they didn't commit to you. They wanted to bring other... Uh, toxic energies in your relationship and some of you guys walked away from them seems like most of you guys walked away from them and now they stuck longing for you lusting for you and masturbating towards you trying to pull on your energy look i'm not happy i need to talk to you now they want to talk like you know subscribe if you got something from this i'm going off the power three till next time in tarot land power three if you pick this lapis lazuli or if you pick this deck this is your reading shout out to you guys hope all is well Hopefully you could get some insight in your situation when you come to this reading. Today's reading is who's masturbating to you. I'll figure out why they masturbating to you. So shout out to you guys. Subscribers new and old. If you're a visitor, welcome. <laughs> I said if you're a visitor, welcome. Yeah, you are welcome for your reading. But if you are a visitor, welcome to the, sh to the channel. And if you are a returning visitor, welcome back. So, let's see. We're going to get right to it. Take with a plot and leave the rest. This person that's um, masturbating to you, this person, it says, has been extremely hurt by a loved one in the past. This person wants to send you a message. That information is in power one because that card came out in power one. Your path will cross after making a final decision. So the universe is going to make you see this person whenever you make a decision and you know the decision you need to make. This person have unusual hair features. This person has a pet or they had a pet and their pet passed away. Or some of them don't have a pet. They cuz it's in reverse. It has a this person have a unique um smile. They have noticeable feature here. It could be unusual and noticeable. This person Name starts with an A E I O U. Now, this person with this unique smile, they in big thought about you. Some of you could have lived together, or if you didn't live together, you spent a lot of time at this person's home. Your birthday could be the 16th or the 21st of any month, or your birthday could be March 16th or July 21st. This person want to send you a message because they see that you disappeared from them. Some of you just disappeared or you walked away from them. You transformed. And where you going, there's light at the end of the tunnel. They feel like you can help them. This person as well want to send you a message because for some of them, they want to stop you from getting too far from them. They don't want you to get too far where they can't like be able to talk to you again somebody birthday could be on the 8th of any month or they could be born in august let's we'll start clarifying this clarify um wants to send you a message what do they want to send to damn i jumped out three of cups came out in every pal and then the four of pentacles the reason why this person want to send you a message because this person was busy partying 
and holding back from you. So now they want to make this right. They want to try to make it right with you because they didn't want to focus on you. They wanted to focus on other people. But now they realize that this is a relationship that they should have focused on. This person could be a person that party with people from other cultures or other walks of the earth. This person tried to push you away. They didn't want to take you on dates. They didn't want to do anything. If they took you on a date, it was somewhere to drink and get you drunk so they can, like, have sex with you. Clarify has a unique smile. Take what apply, leave the rest. When I say what the message is that I just said. Now this person is wounded. They're a wounded warrior. Some of them are scared to talk to you. They have anxiety. They're scared to talk to you. They don't know what to say. It's like they're dragging their feet to come talk to you, come apologize to you, because they know your guides is watching you. Their gatekeepers are protecting you. Clarify this four of pentacles and his three of cups. Why they want to talk to Pal three? The queen of swords, because you're not talking to them. You are, Your cutoff game is serious. You like the hell with them. Screw them. You're going to go take your love somewhere else. If they want to talk to you, they have to be straight, direct. Can't be no bullshit involved. In the meantime, you are enjoying yourself. You are relaxing. You are taking it calm. No matter how emotional the situation is, you're staying grounded and calm. You're showing yourself love. You're giving love to where love needs to be given. The high priestess, y'all notice. You could be a Pisces. You notice about this person. You have the... What is this? The Eight of Cups in reverse? Yep, the Eight of Cups is in reverse. This person is not happy. They're looking at disaster strikes. <laughs> Hold on for a second. Clarify this Eight of Cups in reverse. Teasing. That came out in Pow 2. Dangling truths, being shifty. You are hurting emotionally right now. You need time to heal before you jump in again. This person is crushed. This person is crushed. And this is why they masturbating to you because they want to pull on your energy. Why are they masturbating to power one? I mean, why I say power one? Hold on for a second. This person is being haunted by the memories of you. Why are they masturbating to power three? They attracted to you. They have hot attraction for you. Oh, gosh. It's hidden, too. But this the passion burns for you, for this person. No one could please this person the way you can please this person. This person could be a Pisces. They could be a Virgo. They could be a Capricorn. They could be a Cancer or a strong in a chart. This person could be a Mars, um, a Mars, a Mars, Capricorn, Cancer, Virgo, or a... Uh, Capricorn, Cancer, Virgo, or Pisces. This person could also be an Aries or a Scorpio. Why are they masturbating? Damn it. Look, the transformation that you bring this person. Your sex is... I can't even talk. Your, se your sex got them going crazy. Like and you know, subscribe. Till next time.